Hey people, um, thank you for watching all of my videos and subscribing. Hopefully you, some more people will subscribe in this video. So, this video, I will show you how like to improve your computer speed, technically make it better. And I don't recommend buying new computers. If you have like an old one, you just upgrade the parts. It's 10 times cheaper. So, um, in the, out, um, right now, I'll talk about the video, um, the video card, I believe. So, to access the video card, you will need to remove the thumb screws on the back side of the computer and open it up. Okay, zoom in on the video card for you right now. Uh, this right here, this red thing, is the video card. And what it makes it called a video card is this thing which you plug in the s video or that i had to replace mine because my monitor was going on and off and like blue screens so yeah and how to tell if your um video card is messed up uh, all you gotta do is remove the old one remove the fan that usually covers here i'm talking about old ones i don't know about sophisticated new types of video cards and Check if the little tiny card in the middle is burnt out or not. As you see, this is black, sort of, and messed up. So I had to get a new one and I solved the problem. Okay, sorry for that. Now, then, this is an old computer. It's like 2000, well, 2000 something, I think eight. It's not that old, just four years, but Four years from now, from like now, computer. This is like a snail compared to like other ones. So now, <clears throat> many computers. What makes them fast is the RAM memory, which is like the little four sticks on usually like a side of the the the, the motherboard, which these. So you remove them and. Buy new or like 16 gigabytes or different ones. Okay, this was made for fast because it has four, but low gigabytes. I don't really know. I don't want to lie to you guys. Okay, then the processor. The processor is hidden beneath the central fan, right? So to do that, you unscrew the stuff. Okay, so after you remove the fan, uh, the processor is now accessible. So now the fan, you could tell like it's smudged there, that's thermal paste. You might want to buy some from a Radio Shack, what, for five bucks and reapply it to the processor. But in this case, I won't do it because the processor is also busted. Okay, so to remove the processor, uh, <coughs> It's usually covered by like this bracket thing. So this little hook here, you're gonna have to press down, gent uh, well, gently and push it back up and it'll go uh, open. Then you just pry open the little casing and remove the processor with, well, carefully. And this is uh, the processor. Now, if you want to get like faster computers, they usually have a Core i7 or some, something like that. I'm not really sure. But I don't know what this is and it's pretty, really, really slow. Okay, so I'll put that aside. Okay, then people having internet problems and have dropped a computer before because I understand that's happened to me before. Okay, I will have to put the computer like this now. Okay, this um, here is the internet thingy which has the wireless uh, adapter connected to it. So if it fell on this, you might want to have this checked out at Tiger Direct or Computer USA. So, so like, go to a computer store, which, like, whichever your preference is, or stuff like that. Okay, so there you technically have the main solutions and if your computer crashed, a lot of times, and there's been like power outs at your neighborhood or local area, you might want to have checked out the power supply. Like the fan could have got busted, many things could have gone wrong. 
Okay, so please rate, comment, and subscribe. Tell me if I did good. Uh, yeah, tell me if you guys need something else to explain. If I can continue doing these type of videos, focus more on Xbox or PC. Oh, and by next week, I will be getting the HD PVR2, I think, Hop, Hop Hodge or something like that. And I will make a series of whatever game. So in the comments below, tell me which I should, um, which games I should play. And I'll see you next time.